Omahazu. As you can see the little dome thing back there. It was here four years ago, so now we're back. Let's see what's new. I got a bunch of little tidbits this time, so uh, stick around and I'll throw them out throughout the video, so don't miss one. Let's go tour the Omaha Zoo. Best in America? That kind of stinks that they closed that, but gotta fix things, right? Gotta fix them. Okay, so that was the insect pavilion. Now we're gonna go to the aquarium. Uh, Omaha Zoo tidbit number one, uh, 160 acres. Not the biggest one in the US, but uh, according to USA Today, number one zoo in America. What do you think? Huh, debatable. Uh, I've only been to this zoo, so how the hell would I know? Interesting tidbit number two. There's 900 different, 950 different species and 7,000 total animals here. That's a lot of food. I don't know how much they spend on food, but it's gotta be a lot. to the grassland. This is where the giraffes, elephants, all that good stuff are. Omaha Zoo tidbit number whatever. I kind of lost where I was on that one. Uh, according to the internet, 2021 there was 1.9 million people that visited Omaha Zoo. Which, really? That is not supposed to come off. It just falls off. Nice.
shortcomings. Well, they don't have like like the Los Angeles or San Diego Zoo. It has this trolley that drives you through, and they talk about the different animals. And been here all day, haven't seen one. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen one any time we've ever been here. Like the sky lift thing or whatever, that's always closed. I don't know, it's always broken. Yeah, like true. you got to walk four, five, six acres before you could find anywhere to get a drink. You go towards the entrance, that's where your beverage, water, whatever is. Like, they should have something to get a drink. But apparently, you're allowed to bring in your own food and beverage, so they want you to save a buck. So do that, and you don't need to buy any of their stuff. Yeah, true. Bring your own waters and whatever. Looking like the orangutan one's closed as well. A lot of closed things. Lots of closed up things. So now we're going to the indoor dome, which is final tidbit Omaha Zoo. This is the largest enclosed desert, 84,000 square feet. That's a big old dome. So that's next. Omaha Zoo trip for the day. I'm a little tired, I ain't gonna lie. So, I've been on a couple gripes about me being old and having to walk so much. It's very good. You need some more staff here. You need to open more things. Best zoo in the US? Questionable. But, news things that say it's the best zoo, but it's up there, but I don't know about best. Because I have gripes. Best zoo would have no gripes. Opinion wise, let me know yours in the comments below. Let me know if you think this is one of the best ones. If you've been to another do zoo, tell me what zoo you've been to. I'm interested. I would like to go to other zoos, but nobody has the time or the money to go travel to Brooks or Brooklyn, Bronx or Brooklyn Zoo or, you know, there's one in Toronto that's like three times the size of this. I really want, don't want to walk that, so. Let me know in the comments if you've been to another zoo, what you think of this one. And if you did like this content, please, that thumbs up and a subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.